for the U.S. Postal Service. Again, it's the largest logistic entity in the U.S. Um, and route optimization can save and has been demonstrated to save you know, millions of gallons of gas, for example, uh, on trucks. Um, when carriers uh, call in sick, for example, how to reallocate resources on the fly um, with respect to personnel, environmental, seasonal variation, things like this. So um, the implementation that we've had running for a couple years now uh, in production at the Postal Service um, has maybe 15,000 simultaneous sessions and uh, managers and analysts are, are able to use real-time dashboards driven by, again, that breadcrumb and sensor data about where um, delivery vehicles and carriers are on their routes. Um, and there's 200,000 devices that are emitting location once per minute, um, more than a quarter billion events uh, per day um, on a 10-node cluster. And so, again, one of the themes of, of this presentation will be the orders of magnitude of, of scale that, that can be achieved, uh, the order of magnitude increase in scale. So without that hardware sprawl. And so Postal Service is a great example of that. Um, just a couple of screens here about uh, what the users are, of the system are actually seeing um, as they go about optimizing their, their routes. So these are um, based on the billions of events, but the visualizations, as, as we'll you know, describe, are not pulled from the database over the network to be rendered in a BI tool, for example. That's just not practical at scale. So since we're using GPUs for compute, we also use them to generate these visualizations, both 2D, 3D, still, and videos, um, on the, at the database itself. So the, the, the GPU brings a wealth of capabilities that, that can be exploited in, in the database.